Hey guys, what's up? It's Angel Vicious, and this is Mark Oliveras, and we are going to pierce my anti eyebrows and my high double nostrils. Thank you, Eric, for funding and sponsoring this, I guess you would say. So, uh, yeah, let's go. Getting four piercings. See those? Yeah, I'm horrible at getting makeup off my face, so you probably gotta <laughs> creep it off. I'm not makeup, though. Me. It lasts. <laughs> They don't go nowhere. Fenty Beauty. Yeah. Which ones did you want to do first? The nose or the eye? Which do you want to do first? I'm going to do the nose because then I'll have you lay down for the eyebrow ones. Okay. <clears throat> Nose first. Right, someone mark those and make sure and everything like that. I remember the first time I got these done, Mom was like, don't get your sinuses pierced. I'm like, no. It's like, you know, where the, the, the it's skin. It's cartilage. You're not piercing like above that. <laughs> but you can't actually do that, can't you? That's like, kind of like a bridge thing. You know, I wouldn't do it. Let's see how it looks to you. They're kind of where they were. Looks pretty much exactly where they were. Okay. Ready, guys? <laughs> I have no makeup on. Well, except for my eyebrows, so I'm sorry. I look really gross. Yeah. Which side you want to do first? Mm, you pick. Okay. <laughs> you can't tell I've like, done this a hundred times. Just but you pick. Because he's a great piercer. So you guys should come and see him. He's awesome. Ready? Yep, I'm ready. And stay relaxed. Scar tissue. Yeah. <laughs> and deep breath in and put it down. I didn't even water. <laughs> yeah! It's like a boss. <laughs> Surprisingly, not really be bleeding either. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I thought they were going to bleed. I'm going to give you a couple in case you do feel it bleeding. Sure. I'm sure you remember that when she um, <laughs> do surgery on your belly button, too. You? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Let's talk about that story. Story time while we get pierced. So, um, <laughs> Mark pierced my belly button top and bottom, like, oh, God, years ago. And for some reason, the sure <laughs> the bottom one just didn't want to stay, so he had to basically cut it out. Cause of karate. Yeah, cause of karate. I got kicked in the stomach, so. Yeah, kicked in the stomach of karate, and it like yeah, split that it shit open. Sucked. So the man can even do surgery yeah. if needed. Oh yeah, and he's cut out um, uh, someone's tongue ring before too that like grew over. He cut out one of your ear piercings too. Mm-hmm. So the skin oh, yeah. grew over. And then I remember I really wanted an so industrial. But does, we just decided it this would This man does piercing or either surgery if you <laughs> don't pay attention to it afterwards like Angel. Yeah, I know. It's like, I need to take care of my piercings better, but it's like, I have so many piercings that I'm so used to having. Yeah. It's like, they're just natural to me. Like, it doesn't occur to me like, oh, I, that's a piercing. I need to go clean that. My face. Check out your nostrils real quick. Yeah. And just so you know, I'm oh, yeah, they look good. Guys, so like, I was just telling him a quick story really quick. My nose is crooked, and yes, go ahead and stare, and you can find it, and you can see it's crooked. I, I did a lot of sports. Um... Anyways, my double nostrils always hid that for me for some reason. It, like, distracts from it. So that's why I love them so much. But now it's anti eyebrow time. Right, so I'm going to have you lay down with your head here. Just don't bang your head on the counter. <laughs> it went harder. <laughs> color is like, bleh. There we go. Could you turn your head a little bit towards the wall? Oh, the right. Oh, that's the wall. <laughs> This time, I'm not going to try to take my nose rings out 
to change them. I think that was the biggest problem. It's like I couldn't get them back in, so that's why they're out. These, you know, they just reject after a period mm -hmm. of time, so I just gotta keep getting them done. Okay, deep breath in and the same spot they were in. Yeah. Hey, maybe enough since it's too scratchy, maybe they won't return this time. That'd be cool. That'd be good. Yeah, if not. If not, I'm going to get you to do them again. <laughs> One down. I love this. I love this. Oh, yeah. Looks good. Oh, yeah. Okay, I'm just going to turn your head the other way. Piercings, getting piercings is like therapy to me. It makes me very happy. <laughs> it's just like, yes, another needle. Nah, seriously though, I do love getting piercings and just looking at them afterwards like, oh, that shit's amazing. Trying to poke you in the eye. <laughs> it's happened before. Deep breath in and let it out. scar tissue on this one. Mm -hmm. And surprisingly, you know, the pain is not bad. Good. For the scar tissue, like... Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's like therapy to me. Like, you know, it's like when some people go shopping, and it's like, cures them, or, you know, I guess technically you should probably go to a counselor if you need therapy. <laughs> And I'm crazy, and I just love going to get piercings, tattoos. Yeah. And then once these, to enhance. once these are healed, you can put um, a little bit of a shorter bar in there. Also, smaller balls if you don't like the balls being so big. I actually love them being big. I love big balls. Ha ha ha! Use them so that way, yeah. you know, if it does swell bad, it won't try and pull those tiny balls in. Mm -hmm. So we use the bigger balls. Yeah. Check it out. I actually like the bigger because, you know, it just... It just uh, it stands out and looks really cute. I like that a lot. I could tell you went through that like the scar tissue really hard, so like they are gonna stay. You wanna turn around, <laughs> dude? I feel so happy now. So once again, this is Mark Oliveris. He is okay. like the okay. best piercer around, and uh, just come see him if you live anywhere near the Lynchburg area, or if you just live in Virginia, come and see him. He's awesome. He always does my piercings. They always turn out perfect. And he is really, really, really gentle, which is a cool thing. Because, like, I know I always say on YouTube, be like, oh, I don't feel any pain or whatever. But, you know, everybody feels the pain. It's like, it's like a needle taking out a piece of your skin. Isn't that technically how it goes? Yeah. Think so about it's like, like a tiny cookie cutter. A tiny <laughs> cookie cutter. So it's like, of course you feel it. But it's like... That pain's so temporary, and then and then you get the it's, pain's temporary. The piercings can be permanent if you want to keep it. So, anyways, to close this video, one more time, thank you, Mark, mm -hmm. and thank you, Eric, for sponsoring and paying for these piercings. They rock. All right, guys, subscribe, like, comment. Let me know what you guys want to see. Oh, Bye. I don't know where he's at. Oh yeah. Oh shit. Yeah. Mark, Mark, he is here at Kiss of Ink, and it's on Tempera Waterlick, Waterlick, like where the Waterlick Plaza. Yeah, the Waterlick Plaza. I can put like the location. information all up in here. Yeah, <laughs> location and stuff. But yeah, uh, so that was fun. <laughs>